Hello guys, Link K here back on Terra Tech, and today we're going to do a couple things actually. We're going to be flying this thing, we're going to actually take off on the salt flat, and we are going to try and attempt to start working on a repair base. Alright, so it's saying make sure you have enough space ahead and everything for takeoff. Would you look at that? Okay, there's a lot of weight on this aircraft and we're stalling out. That's not good. It's landing us right here next to a baddie. Oh, jeez. I never want to see an aircraft do that. Okay, you know what? I got the perfect solution for that. Alright, see this gyroscope right up here? That's going to be our best friend when it comes to these. Alright, so stick that gyroscope in the within the bubble. Yeah, there's no room left in this bubble. Look at that. There's no room left. So, we're going to have a long... What was that crunching noise? Is there something following me? Do I have a friend? Alright, bubble... Let's take this. Hey, you stop moving. We're not done yet. All right. Here we go. Oh, come on. We were going to start today with that, but looks like we got a little friend that's a little on the close side. Okay, that was too easy. That was a little on the easy side. Alright, any new pieces from our little buddy here? Doesn't seem so. Oh, he had a. He had a bubble. Yeah, a little bubble projector. We need that. So thank you, little guy. Alright, so let's get this thing in the air. That was a little too close for comfort. But look at that. Keep the tech level if you can. We have a beautiful level flight. No complaints. No complaints. Look at that. Looks like I got the hang of this now. Of course I do. I'm an ace pilot. No, I'm not. i pretty sure if somebody were to hand me, uh, you know, anything for an aircraft, I'd probably be like, uh, guys? Oh, look at that. We got something new this way. Let's actually, go check this out, because we could get a new part, which actually would be really cool. Alright, so, we're nearing this part, and it's something we already have. Okay, we don't need that so much. Wow, this thing gets lift really fast. Alright. Okay, we don't need this thing. So let's just sit down the ground because that's It's it's not needed. We already have some. All right. Moving on. We got us a little airplane. We're going to keep on flying. We got a new piece coming up. What will you be? A. Ooh! What is that? Bunny ears? Yes! Yay! Bunny ears! Yay! Bunny ears! Alright, that's great. As. That's, that's really great. Alright, so. This seems to be a really badlandish planet, from what I'm seeing. Alright. Up, 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 and away! see how high we can get this little little aircraft all right 
seems like we're getting now the render distance and height which is kind of good because that means we won't have anybody shooting at us that's kind of bad because <laughs> we can't see where we're going really and we gotta rely solely on the map radar I don't like doing that so much all right so I think we are maybe about halfway there but look at that we got our little bunny ear aircraft and everything that this is cool this is really nice all right let's just get home real quick and we can hear the engine from that vehicle all right yeah we are almost home because right over there is the GSO trading port all right beautiful can we come in for a soft glide nope we're coming in too harsh and we're getting too close to that guy up 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 <laughs> oh, not so fast Sunny. Eh? still got a lot to learn come on come on come on little birdie come on birdie burb 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 and touchdown beautiful all right that's that was a pretty successful flight if you ask me all right so let's go take care of this little guy who shot at our bird all right he seems to be like a Uzi surprise or something like that I think that's the name EXP battery okay actually we need to take out that because I need that battery these batteries are insane alright these things are absolutely insane they got like eight times the charge of a normal battery and for something like if we we're going to build a larger war rig or something that is something that we desperately need okay so I think now what we got to do is take our little tech right here let's actually save this thing because this is actually a very nice design let's call this the pit driver uh, it's about the best name I can come up with and I do not want to tweet this and it would be just total ass nine if we are going to be using this as an invader because it's got absolutely no it's got absolutely no offense alright so it's pop our tail light on here makes me sad cuz now we don't have a tail light I like the lights on this game they just cause a lot of lag but let's run and there's a nice little firefight going on over here look at that that's a that's a nice little firefight too bad we don't have any weapons or I would love to join in on the partying okay so GSO as soon as I can stop flailing around like an idiot let's grab us so we got blocks we need a fixed anchor all right we need we'll say two generators about three batteries uh, this is protection this is actually going to be needed too so we'll need two of these and about four of these all right so we have four of those and actually we need to set all this together now this is going to be a very heavy vehicle in the butt But to counter that, we have these wheels, which are going to be great for this. Alright, so let's pop all these bubbles here. Uh, we actually need 
you to get on the other side, but we'll get to that in a second. All right, there we go. We have the entire vehicle. We have our repair assembly. Let's see how much our techs cost. All right, so the buggy is 320. We can't buy the war. Oh, come on. We can't buy the oh, draft, the guy, trash, or giga horse. Ground hat. Well, we can buy the ground house for fourteen thousand, but we can't stay here because this thing's got no defenses, and that whatever this is going to be is going to eat us for lunch. It's just going to eat us all together. All right. So let's just wheel our fat butt home, and we will start building our base. Scrapyard warrior. I don't like the name of that one. I don't like the name of that one one bit. That one actually does sound like it's got some power behind it. Alright. Let's uh, take off the booty of this vehicle. Alright. Let's start here. I have a solar panel on top. The four battery core. Because, well, we need batteries. And are you telling me that the sun's already going... Oh, okay, we still got some time. I was actually worried there for a second that the sun was already about to go down. I was about to say, these episodes just seem to get shorter and shorter every passing run. Alright, so, okay, so I think it was a couple episodes ago we actually found a three block. Actually, no, that needs to go here. Because that's a shield. Let's put a healing core here. Alright, let's put another shield here. Oh, actually, that doesn't overlap. Okay. Alright, Warboy, we're going to have to take some pieces off of you. Because you are merely just merely just a, uh, what do you call it? A vessel that is holding our scrap. That's why you don't have a radar or anything really overly important. That's... Okay. Okay, what can we take off of you? I'm going to have to keep taking off a lot of things, but there we go. Alright, let's try and Stick whatever we can on this machine. Oh wait, you will. Oh, that's a gun. You will. You go over here. Lamp. Now oh, you go back on the air. You go back on that. Okay, let's move this war boy out of the way. Or I, I keep calling it a war boy, but it's not really a war boy. Okay. Let's repair this vehicle. Well, not repair it so much, but there we go. I don't like the fact that it's not as big as I wanted it to be. Okay. And the sun is already going down? Are you kidding me? Like, it shouldn't be going down already. That's... These days, I might have to increase the length of these episodes starting, you know, within the next few. Because, oh my gosh, they do not last long at all. Like, it seems only, you know, about two minutes that these things have gone. But then again, you know what? We did do a lot of flying. We did do a lot of flying, so that's probably a huge cause to that. Alright, so let's test this thing out. Does this thing sustain mid-sized vehicles? This is still technically a small vehicle, but we'll say mid-size for the record. Alright, so there we go. It works, kinda. I'm thinking about increasing the height on this thing. We'll go to it at another point, maybe off camera, work on this some more. But until then, this is what we got for our thing. 
And I can't believe it's already nightfall. That's that's sad. I mean, it's not sad, but it, it's sad that the episode's already over. Because I really like playing this game. Like, I really, 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 really enjoy doing this. And here's Mr. Bun-Bun. Actually, let's save this aircraft to calling it Mr. Bun-Bun. Uh, you know what? There we go, Mr. Bun-Bun. Okay, Mr. Bun-Bun is now a saved vehicle. And now, I think tomorrow, or whenever, I'm, I'm still saying tomorrow. I'm just going to say this right now. These are all bulk recordings, so I'm going to keep saying tomorrow. This is going to be a daily episode, for those who don't know. That's what I'm going to be putting it as. Alright, anyways, guys, this is going to do it for today. Sorry, that little guy up there just caught my attention. I want to do something about it, but I'm going to do that at a later point. But, again, this is going to do it for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed, as always, and I will see you guys next time where we will continue on conquering and we will take out that invader because honestly these invaders are kind of uh, invasive that's all I can say and I think what we'll do is take Mr. Bun Bun out and we will go look for some more pieces actually we'll do that too because honestly it's kind of necessary to go look for more pieces in order to progress but yeah that's all for future plans and again I will see you guys next time